The History of English in 10 Minutes. Chapter 1, Anglo-Saxon, or Whatever Happened to the Jutes. The English language begins with the phrase, Up yours, Caesar, as the Romans leave Britain, and a lot of Germanic tribes start flooding in. Tribes such as the Angles and the Saxons, who together gave us the term Anglo-Saxon, and the Jutes, who didn't. The Romans left some very straight roads behind, but not much of their Latin language. The Anglo-Saxon vocab was much more useful, as it was mainly words for simple everyday things like house, woman, loaf and werewolf. Four of our days of the week were named in honour of Anglo-Saxon gods. They didn't bother with Saturday, Sunday and Monday, as they'd all gone off for a long weekend. While they were away, Christian missionaries stole in, bringing with them leaflets about jumble sales and more Latin. Christianity was a hit with the locals and made them much happy to take on funky new words from Latin like martyr, bishop and font. Along came the Vikings with their action man words like drag, ransack, thrust and die. They may have raped and pillaged, but they were also into give and take. Two of around 2,000 words they gave English, as well as the phrase, watch out for that man with the enormous axe. <laughs>